Today's episode is going to be winning your twin babies part two. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So now that you know the basics on how and when to win your babies, in this video I wanted to talk about the winning products, must-haves and regrets. So these are my first first purchases since we just started winning. Let's start with winning must-haves. These are IKEA bowl um, products. I find this very very cheap, very good um, quality and you know the size is good as well and stackable. So this come in three pieces. I like this. And then I also bought some cups. This is their trainer cups, IKEA trainer cups. I like that it's very simple since my babies are, you know, barely grabbing, but this is really good. The handle, I like how the handle looks like and, you know, very sturdy. The plastic quality is really good. So, this is one of my must have. So, I got two of this. For the spoon, oh, this is their winning spoons from IKEA. I got like two of this two sets so this is like one set one is longer and the other one is smaller so we normally just use this longer one because it's easier to hold and you know it's it's very very sturdy I think my babies like it it just fits in their mouth properly so I like how this IKEA is cheap and useful so for the baby storage I just recently bought this these are the first years, my first years take and toss um, bowls. So it comes in like seven pieces a pack and is very cheap. I wanted to make batches for their baby food and I can just put them here. Like I don't normally make it full, okay? So I make it until let's say three fourths of this and then I close it out and I stack it in the fridge. So I started actually with the um, ice cube tray but it's just so much things to do for food storage I really like this one of course you cannot make the baby food without a mixer this is my mixer so I like that it's very compact easy to clean very compact it's not complicated at all I need a high chair so we purchased an IKEA high chair and the IKEA cushion it suits them perfectly when they are seated I don't normally buckle them up because it's just perfect for them the fitting is just perfect they cannot move or anything what else? Bibs. It's must have to have bibs. Okay, what we're using right now is just a normal bibs, but I think I'm going to purchase the large ones later when they started grabbing things. So these are very essential for me. Yes, I don't like to have complicated stuff. So these are really simple for me. Let's talk about my regrets. This boon um, suction bowl. I actually like this one. It's good later, but not now when you're starting to win your baby. Since now they cannot grab the spoon and feed themselves. Another product regret, of course, is the tummy TP, which I just talked about in my other video. Um, I really hate that this product was not recalled in my place. This is how it looks like, guys. Okay, if you have one of these, have them replace the valve inside, which is this one. Have them replace this. This is really dangerous for your babies. I think I'm not going to use this at all. So, yeah, this is a waste of money. Another thing which I regret that I purchased are this weaning pots. I think they are good, but the only problem, it's a little bit expensive, you know, and you get only two pieces. So, if I have two babies, I need more than two pieces to stock their food. Yeah, with the price, I don't think it's uh, I like to be practical. So, this doesn't work for me. Okay, I got this Munchkins teaspoon. Comes in four pieces. Okay. Initially, I thought that this would be good because it has this sensor, like, you know, the color changes when you put hot uh, food. And it would be a lot easier for the baby to feed. But when you grab it, since it's very small, it's not really easy to grab. Plus, this tape is thick. I ended up not using this as well if you can see the difference between this so this one is like a scoop one 
and this is more like a flat one yeah so the ice cube tray the silicone one I also regret purchasing that one because I never use it there is a smell coming out on it and I don't like how it smells there's one more thing I regret buying I did bought the Philips Avent um, two-in-one steamer blender for the babies I figured out I don't really need it a lot of parts that I have to clean afterwards and when I tried it the first time because I have to steam the vegetables and blend it there are still lumps of the carrots which I blended and I didn't see that so I got scared that Zane might choke when I feed him but thank God he didn't then I said no I don't want this with this um, mixer I see that everything has been mashed that is my winning must-haves and regrets I do hope that you like this video and I'll see you in my next video